What is going on, everybody? Welcome back. We got yet another video for you. Today is going to be a good one. One I've been wanting to rip for a little while now. We got 2023 Tops Museum Collection. The Corbin Carroll on the front. Little poster boy. Uh, these boxes, uh, unfortunately, I bought these right when they came. I think it was either pre-sale or right when they came out for like $375. Bucks. Um, <clears throat> I think you can get them for under $300, maybe just right at $300. So they dropped in value, which is unfortunate. Um, but I think people were opening them up. I don't know if like one of the case hits got, or the product hits got, got hit or something. That's why the value went down or what. Maybe people didn't like what they were pulling, but... It's a tough pull. I've seen a lot of boxes opened. Um, a lot of really not good boxes. I mean, it's a tough, tough pull. But saying that, you can pull some crazy stuff out of here. A lot of, like, um, bat barrels and uh, um, booklets, tons of booklets that I've seen pulled. So this one, when I got it, I was a little bit curious because it's, it's got a little dent in little indent there so configuration of the box four mini boxes in the master box you're gonna get one on card autograph one autograph relic one quad relic and a regular relic so lots of relics there you have it this is the first time opening museum collection i've always wanted to open these just because of a. Uh, some of the stuff I've seen pulled out of the out of the years, because this, this product's been around for a while. Huh? I don't know. We'll see. Hoping to get a booklet. I want a booklet. That'd be pretty sweet. Bat Barrel One Hundred One. That'd be dope. A good autograph. Autograph relic. Okay. So we're looking for the two autographs expensive product we'll see see if I like it all right first mini box I think you get like one copper parallel per box Bryce Harper oh we got a thicky here looks like we might have a relic so first take on the cards Huh. Kind of plain design, honestly. Joey Votto. Put the base over here. Miguel Vargas. Okay. Got our copper back here. Shohei! Copper Shohei. Put our parallels and number cards over there. Alright, we got a some sort of patch here or something. This could be just the relic. Is it vertical? No, it looks like it's sideways. <clears throat> All right, signature. This is the big. This is basically the big hit. Signature swatches. It's a brave. Okay, we got a lot of good options we can see here. <laughs> Let's hope uh, for the Acuna. Nope. Austin Riley, though. That's actually pretty good. Not bad. For the signature swatches, this one is numbered to... Really? 253. That's interesting. I don't know what that number represents. Because that is a very specific number. 143 of 253. Game used, Austin Riley. That's that's a good uh, it's a good hit. I mean, it could have been way worse, way worse. It'd have been nice to see the Acuna there, but hey, hey, you can't win them all, all right? All right, let's let's leave this one up. <clears throat> I'm gonna be kind of taking my time on this one just because it's a uh, coming. Kind of you know, it's a first rip for me. I've never opened this before, so I kind of want to just enjoy it. Especially losing money already at the 300 paying, paying the most expensive you 
price for this box. You can, basically. Okay, so let's throw this down there. Okay, I actually thought that one felt the lightest, so maybe I got like a, maybe I got a bat barrel in the other one. Maybe I got a Shohei Otani 101 bat barrel. That'd be nice. What do we got? We got another thicky. This could be, oh, and a gold. Ooh. <laughs> Ichiro. Juan Soto. Jordan Walker rookie card. That's nice. All right, we got a relic here. Let's pull from the back our gold. Ezekiel Tovar at a 299. Prospect, I guess. Prospect auto. Major League. He had nine games. He went seven for 33. One home run. Franchise youngest player to ever start on opening day. All right. I've heard it too far. Put him next to Shohei. All right. Let's see our relic. <clears throat> Almost grabbed another box. Ha! <laughs> All right, what do we got here? What do we got? Something good? I see a number. I see a number. 34 of 99. Who is it? Byron Buxton. Quad. That is going to be our quad relic. Primary pieces. There you go. Quad. Byron Buxton. Let's leave him up. Okay, put, put him next to the hits. All right, so, so far, two mini boxes. We got the Austin Riley, numbered Ezekiel Tovar, Byron Buxton, quad relic. Third mini box. So now we're looking for our regular relic. And we still have an autograph. Oh, an autograph. This might be the auto. Huh. Oh, there we go. Ken Griffey Jr. Cedric Mullins. Oh. Ken Griff on the canvas collections. See if this is numbered. Byron Buxton on our copper. This one is not numbered. The canvas collection. You can get numbered ones of these. I think one of ones even. Kind of cool. Cool design. All right, so autograph. Auto, batter. Swing bada bada, another Braves. Could it be another Austin Riley? That'd be weird. Give me a Ron Lacuna. Tell me you want wingy. Vaughn Grisham. All right, on card. <clears throat> it's actually not bad. It's a Braves box though. Put that copper there. To two ninety nine, both pretty high number, which is not good. But those that is the two big hits of the box. Sleeve this one up, some nice thick. These are probably like a hundred point one, maybe even one thirties. Okay. So the last box is going to have our relic in there. Let's hope it's a good relic. Yes, I'm not particularly, I mean, out of all the Braves we could have hit, we hit two rookies, right? Isn't Riley a rookie? I don't see the end of them. Maybe he was last year rookie. This one seems overly thick. I don't think we got a bat barrel. They get some red. Oh, wow. They kept Wander Franco in here. 
Uh, update on Wander Franco. He is apparently on the run. And, uh, yeah, it's not looking good for him. Possible never play baseball again. All right, we got a red. Padres. Could it be a Soto? A Tatis to 50. It's a pretty good hit. Tatis to 50. I was hoping it was going to be to five. Corners are all right. They're not that great. There's a little bit of a ding to it. So we got two numbered cards there. Two numbered cards along with our hits. What do we get for a relic? This is going to be a Mariner. And it's going to be numbered, number one of, whoa, one of 15 Mariners. <clears throat> Could we hit a J-Rod relic to 15? J.P. Crawford. Meaningful materials. Game used. 1 of 15. All right. A little two color. A little two color there. Might even be three colors. A little another color hiding under there. Um, all right. Museum collection. Wow, that one's got a cool little purple. Purple to it. One out of 15. Dang, if that would have been a freaking J-Rod. That would have been nice. Corners are not too bad. It's actually in pretty good shape. Get this in a big sleeve. Got the tattoos to 50, so honestly, it's not too bad. It could have been worse. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right, we got J.P. Crawford to 15. Byron Buxton to 99. Quad relic. The Tatis to 50. Tovar to 299. Vaughn Grissom to 299. One card auto. Nice looking card though. And an Austin Riley signature swatches. And these are all game used. Everything's game used, so. And hit some big stuff in here. This was definitely a Braves box. With both the hits being the Braves. So, tell me what you think. Obviously, 300 bucks. Uh, I don't know. I maybe. I don't know. I, I did. I think I did pretty well. <clears throat> Honestly, I mean, I would assume those are probably going for maybe 100 a piece. Maybe less. Maybe like 60. Gosh, it's tough to say. Because just the numbering is so high to 299 the Tatis alone could be, you know, that could be a $10, $10, dollars card. Tovar, I don't know about him too much. Um, but still numbered, uh, two numbers, uh, four other hits, two autographs, two relics. I mean, it's a pretty good, I guess it's pretty good. That uh, J.P. Crawford to 15, I mean, any other player, that would have been a pretty big hit. But I cannot complain for um, the box. Yeah, it could have been worse. I've seen a lot of worse. This is uh, going to go down as, we'll put it down as a dub. This one is another dub. I think, I don't know, I've been on a pretty good streak here getting pretty good boxes. So I think I'm due for another big one. The last one we hit, uh, last big one was that 101 Jeter Downs. Spencer Jones to 15. We've been, I've been hitting some shiznit here. But uh, there you have it. Museum Collection 2023 is in the books. I'm not getting another one of these, I don't think. So try it again. Maybe next year we'll see how it goes. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll catch you on the next one.